We have learned today the pregnant mother who was shot and killed during a home invasion has become an organ donor. Meantime, police are looking for any information that will lead to Amanda Blackburn's killer. Our Crime Beat reporter Steve Jefferson joins us live from the coroner's office where an autopsy will take place today. Steve? Yeah, uh, Scott, we just learned that the autopsy is underway right now here at the coroner's office. In many cases uh, like this one, detectives themselves will show up for the autopsy so they can have access to immediate information from the autopsy so they can share that with other detectives working on the case. Amanda Blackburn's family shared a number of photographs with Eyewitness News showing her with her husband and in some of the photographs their toddler. Pastor Davy Blackburn came home Tuesday morning to their Northwest Indianapolis home and found Amanda unconscious, presumably dead from a gunshot wound, something the coroner will determine during the autopsy underway right now. The reported burglary turned murder rocked their neighborhood, and their neighbors met Wednesday night with Metro police officers to talk about being safe as police continue to look for Amanda's killer. It's our responsibility to protect our neighborhood and where we live. And, and it's not only our responsibility, but it's everybody's responsibility in the city of Indianapolis and, and anywhere really because we owe it to ourselves and it's, it's, it's on us to, to create a safe place to, to live. If you're following us on Twitter, you may have seen earlier today where I tweeted that the Ten Point Coalition and local clergy, they're working on having a vigil this coming Sunday to support Pastor Davey Blackburn and his family. They want to invite everyone out to that vigil uh, and also to talk about uh, addressing this type of crime. Meantime, police, they still urge anyone with information about Amanda Blackburn's murder to call Crime Stoppers. You can do so anonymously. That telephone number is 262 TIPS. Scott, the coroner says that uh, she will wrap up the autopsy later this afternoon and release her findings to police, and we expect to get as much information as possible uh, to help the police uh, who are looking for Amanda Blackburn's killer. We'll share that information with you as we get it. Back to you.